doing another Nasty Gal try on haul. I know you all love to see these on my channel. I love Nasty Gal because they are an affordable size inclusive brand. And I'm gonna be trying on some of their plus size summer items today. I haven't really done any summer shopping yet this year. And I mean, even though we're sitting inside the house, it's pretty hot outside. So I thought I would show you some cool dresses, some skirts, some really fun things. This video is sponsored by Nasty Gal, but as you all know, if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, I am always going to give you my full honest opinion. And if you're interested in shopping, all of these Nasty Gal products will be linked in the description box below in case you wanna purchase them. I haven't tried any of these on yet. This is gonna be my first impression right along with you. So let's go ahead and try them on. Okay, so first up, we've got a couple of dresses and then we've got some skirts and tops, which I'll get into. But this first one is a cowl neck, like satin slip dress. I've actually been looking for a really cute satin slip dress that's in like a white color. Cause I just don't ever get those, especially in my size, let's be honest. So I was really excited about this one. This is a UK 18, a US size 14. It's called the Sought After Cowl Plus Mini Dress. It's so cute. It feels decently not see-through. I mean, most slip dresses kind of are. I can see my hand through it, but I most likely will wear bike shorts underneath it anyways. And by most likely, I mean definitely I can't wear a dress without bike shorts because I will chafe to death. It has adjustable straps right here. It does look a little bit big. I'm contemplating whether I would wear like a shirt under it and then maybe wear like a belt with it or if I would just wear it on its own and like throw a leather jacket and some heels on, I'm not sure. It's really soft. It's not like that crinkly kind of like dry satin material if that makes sense. It's really soft and buttery. Sometimes cowl necks are hit and miss on me but I really want this to work so. Let's hope. All right, so here we have the first one. This actually turned out so much better than I thought. This is my standard typical size, which is a size 14. I do like the cowl neck. It's interesting because I think I've ordered two cowl neck tops in the past and I ended up like reselling or donating them because it was just like a little bit too low. But because these straps are adjustable, I have them pulled up pretty high. I feel like it's a bit more manageable like this. And I don't know, this is super cute. Like this, you could get married in this low key. I think there would be so many little fun things you could do with this to dress it up, accessorize it, different shoes you could wear. But yeah, really soft, feels really good quality. It feels like the straps are, you know, in place and secure. They're not gonna fall all over the place. I don't know, you'll have to let me know what you think, but I think we're off to a good start. I'm kind of feeling myself, you know, I've felt a little insecure in slip dresses these days and I haven't been wearing them as much, but I don't know, I might need to like, get back into it. Next up for another satin dress because I just can't get enough of them. I saw this on the website and I was like, wait, this is the cutest dress ever. It's got this really pretty floral print on it as I'm sure you can see. And this is called the Plus Jacquard Smock Dress. This is in a UK size 18, so a US size 14. It has adjustable straps in the back as well. And this color is just so stunning. And I really, I mean, I know I say this for every video, but I really love the idea of wearing this with some combat boots. I just think that that would be such a cute little like feminine and more masculine thing put together. I don't think I've actually seen a lot of like these kind of satin slip dresses that are more of a midi length as well. So I think that'll be really interesting. We're gonna see. Okay, so here is this one. I don't know how I feel about it. It's a cute dress. I just don't know if it's the one for me. I love the color. I think it's very adorable. It's really comfortable. It's very nice for these warmer months because it's super, super lightweight. So you're not gonna be like sweating a ton in it. I do love the way that it, you know, sits on my body. I have been doing my best to kind of step outside my comfort zone with my style lately. So you'll have to let me know your thoughts in the comments below, but I think it's a beautiful dress, beautiful color, beautiful material. Love the way it hangs. I just don't know if it's the dress for me. Next, we've got a couple of skirts and these are so much fun. I love these kind of floral wrap skirts. This one is a faux wrap, which honestly bless up. It doesn't have a tie on it, but it has like kind of the look of a faux wrap dress. And this is called the Plus Frill Hem Skirt. I got this in a US size 14. I love this print. It kind of has like an asymmetrical thing going on right here at the bottom with like the little ruffles. This is really versatile. It's gonna go with a lot of things. I'm really curious to see how it fits and how high waisted it is. And then to put with it, I picked out a band tee, which I know I have many of we're all aware. I don't really wear them as much anymore, but I thought that these two paired together would be so adorable. So I got this shirt, which is a Fleetwood Mac Rumors shirt. I love this album. I love this band. This is called the Fleetwood Mac Plus Graphic Band Tee. I got it in a size 14. This actually feels very like Carrie circa 2018, but I don't know, maybe that era is coming back around. Who knows? Okay, my friends, this is an outfit. I love 
everything about this. You know, I was kind of a little nervous when I was first zipping up the skirt, which by the way, fits great. I'm typically like a US size 14 or 16, but this 14 fits really, really well. When I was zipping up this skirt, I was a little nervous because I was like, oh no, it's a bit tighter. And as you know, I am on a body confidence journey along with all of you that are probably watching this video. And so I was like, is it gonna be unflattering? Is it gonna be too tight and accentuate my stomach? And I feel really comfortable in this. I don't mind that I have a stomach. It's like there's organs in there. It's just part of life. And I love the way this looks. I think the shirt is adorable. I rolled up the sleeves a little bit just for something extra. I think this combo is perfect. It's exactly what I was hoping for when I was looking into this outfit and putting it together in my head online. And I am a little bit taller. I'm like around 5'9", and it still is a great length on me. I was a little bit curious as to where it was gonna sit, especially because, you know, it's a bit high-waisted and I'm really happy with it. So I like the way this looks a lot. I'm really happy. Next, we have another floral skirt. Actually, pretty much everything in this haul is florals because you know it's summer it's the rules so we have another skirt this one is a real wrap skirt so you do kind of have to like maneuver it but here's what it looks like <laughs> this is called the plus size floral ruffle mini skirt uk size 18 us size 14 i love this print i love this color it just seems like right up my alley honestly and i love the fact that it has this kind of like little flap in the front here i love when wrap skirts and dresses do that so to go with it i picked out this little top which we all know i've been loving like a square neck milkmaid top recently and i love this one it's got these really funky sleeves this one is called the plus size organza puff sleeve top I actually ordered this one in a uk size 16 or a us 12 i believe that was all that they had available but it is so cute i could picture it tucked into some cut off denim shorts and especially with a little skirt like this like this is just so girly and pretty so i'm really excited to kind of like play with my style a little bit with this and both of these would be really pretty mix and matched with other items so let's see what it looks like okay wait this one is so much fun this top is extremely comfortable right here i'm not gonna lie it is a little bit pokey in the arms i would consider this more of like a special occasion type of top where you're not gonna wear it for an extended period of time because i am getting a little bit red it is pokey right here but it's so stinking cute like if you were gonna have a cute little instagram photo shoot this might be perfect for that and then for the skirt i was a little intimidated by the wrap situation at first but i figured it out and it looks really cute and it feels really secure like i don't feel exposed at all i don't feel weird like if you know the wind gust happened we're fine here. It's at a good length that I like too, and I wear my skirts super high-waisted. Like I basically wear my skirts to my boobs, if you couldn't tell. And this looks great. It's still a perfect length. I could totally easily wear bike shorts with it underneath. So this is gonna be a really cute, fun little thing to have in my wardrobe, I'm so excited. Next, we've got another dress. It's this pretty pink number, and I believe I sized up in this. Yes, I did. It's the plus size floral wrap frill dress in pink. I was worried with the material that it might shrink in the wash so we're gonna see what it looks like it's a u.s size 16 when i was taking this stuff out of the package and hanging it up here drew was up here hanging out with me and he said this one was his favorite it looks really pretty so it has the boyfriend stamp of approval it's got a cute little tie right here again it's got that little like flap in the front but it's not a real flap so like it can't fly up and like, your leg flies out but judging just based off of the way it looks on the hanger it's really pretty and i really love it i think drew definitely had the right idea with this one this is super super pretty and i actually I actually think I was dead on in my kind of like guesstimation. I am really glad that I ordered a size up in this because I do feel like it will shrink in the wash just because of the material, but it's so pretty and I feel like it's gonna be even better when it is washed and dried. It's just gonna fit me a little bit better, but it still fits now. It's slightly big, but it's honestly totally could walk out of the house and wear this today. I love the sleeves. I think they're so pretty. I love that this is all of the benefits of a wrap dress without actually being a wrap dress. Like see, it's a fake. You could probably wear like full length bike shorts with this and totally get away with it. You would not be able to see it at all. I forgot to mention that it does also have a lining underneath. So if you were worried about it being too sheer or whatever, you do have a little bit of extra protection. I don't have anything bad to say about this at all. It's a really beautiful dress overall, really affordable and super freaking cute. Next up, we've got a fun little dress that I was actually unboxing. I was taking it out of the package and I was like, wait, they sent me the wrong item. And then I was like, 
No, I remember this. This is so cute. It's an oversized kind of like little baby doll dress, I guess you could say. And I've been loving playing around with like neutrals and brown colors now that my hair is a bit darker. I think this will be really pretty. This is called the plus size Jersey scuba dress in the color camel. We all know I love a camel color. I love dresses like this in the summertime that you can literally just throw on and then you have a whole complete outfit. It feels really soft. I ordered this in a UK size 16, US size 12 because I figured it was a bit more over Size and sometimes when that's the case, I can definitely size down to a size 12 and totally be fine. So we're gonna see. This is one of the comfiest dresses I've ever worn in my entire life. It feels like I'm wearing pajamas. I might wear it as pajamas, to be honest. I'm really glad I decided to size down because since it is like a more oversized baby doll style dress, it runs a little bit bigger. So I'm glad I went with a 12 in this. It is so cute. Super, super buttery soft. I love just like the entire entirety of it. Just, just all. The sleeve length is great. I've been having a little bit of insecurity about my arms lately and so what makes me feel comfy sometimes is having them covered. Even though in this video I'm wearing a tank top, it's a journey, okay? We're all going through it. It's totally okay to admit that you're having moments in your journey and dips and setbacks, but this actually makes me feel really comfortable arms-wise. I love it. I would ideally wear this on a day where I was like really bloated and just feeling like bleh and the last thing you wanna do is wear pants pants when you're on your period. And now moving forward, when you see me wearing this, you're just, you're gonna know. It's gonna be our little secret. Next up, we have another floral dress. Who's surprised? Not me. This dress is called the Plus Wrap Floral Print Maxi Dress. This is a UK size 16, US size 12. Again, just because, well, my waist ain't that small. Let's take that off. Mostly just because, again, it's a little more oversized. And so I think this will be a great fit for me. It's just a really pretty semi wrap dress, but like, again, don't have to tie anything. Love that. Comes with this little belt you can tie around the waist if you want. You could belt it as well. Feels very, very 90s. Like more than anything in this, this one just feels like like I'm Drew Barrymore and that is honestly my goal in life. We all know I love a Julia from the Wedding Singer moment. So um, let's see if this holds up to that because I now have my hopes up. This dress, I don't know if you can see it to the end. <clears throat> This dress is really pretty. I love a lot of things about it. It's a little bit low cut, so there's no like hook or button or anything here to make it kind of like enclosed. So you would have to either go braless or maybe you could even just like safety pin it or something like that. But it's very cute. I love the leg. The leg moment's cute. To me, it feels a little more sophisticated and mature, which I kind of am like dipping my toe into that world of fashion. Cause you know, I have always dressed like a teenager. That's just how I am. Here's a little bit of a side view. Here's what it looks like from the side, from the back. I see you looking. Very flowy and very pretty dress. And last but not least, we have this little number, which I think I might be the most excited to try out. So this is called the Plus Size Puff Sleeve Sheared Mini Dress. It just is so pretty. I love these like sheer sleeves. The square neck is gonna be so pretty. It's a little bit like tighter and ruched up here, like towards the chest and the bust. It's just all kind of like one length. There's no like wraps or anything like that. It's just a pretty straightforward dress. The sleeves have this fun little like bell sleeve at the end because they kind of bunch right at the wrist. I like having different dresses for different themes and occasions in mind. I really just had the idea pop up in my head that you could go to a winery and wear this. So cute. I ordered this in a UK size 18. So again, US size 14 and it's just so pretty. I'm really excited to see what this looks like on. Okay, wow, what a way to end this off. This is so different than anything I have. It's sort of giving me like medieval vibes a little bit or maybe even like Outlander or Game of Thrones. I'm not mad at it. It's truly so unique. It's very, very poofy in the sleeves. Then there's like an extra ruffle moment happening right here on top of the sleeve. So it like kind of makes it extra roughly. I feel like this is like a fancy, fancy, like if you're going out for like a really nice date night, throwing on some heels. The length is great. It's like that kind of nice midi length, mid axi if you will. So again, 
throwing it back to you. Let me know what you think in the comments below. What kind of outing would you picture wearing this dress to? I'd love to know. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, be sure to turn on my post notifications if you wanna be notified every time I post a new video. Let me know in the comments what your favorite look was. I don't know, I'd be very curious to know. If there are any other brands that you wanna see me do try-ons or check out or be the guinea pig for you, let me know in a comment below. But I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.